what's up today I'm going to show you how you can create a multi-step forms using gravity forms so as you can see here I have created a website simple website and we have here, we have here a gravity multi-step form and we will I will show you how it works so this is a three step multi-step forms so let's just test this one and then click continue and we will now go to same page and with step 2 this is a one forms but in multi-step view so let's just select for example this one and let's go to next and this is the final you can input this one go to submit so this is integrated in active campaign list forms but for now we'll just uh, explain how these forms created using gravity forms now go to your dashboard in your wordpress admin and just install a gravity forms this one here so if you are going to, to integrate it in your active campaign you just need to install a gravity forms active campaign add-on so that's it and now once you have activated the gravity forms just go to you will see a forms and just click that one so mine I've already created this one as you can see which is seen here so what we are going to do let's just go and uh, create a new forms which have a two step or maybe three steps so for a demo so just go click add then let's name the form to demo form then create form now it will load up in this page here so if you are uh, installing add-ons of active campaign you will see it in the settings here then if not you want only to have this just go so just go on this and then since we are going to create similar that has a three step We'll just go on as you can see we have here an advanced fields post fields and pricing fields so what I'd like I like in this gravity forms is that they have a multi-step form so now we're going to drag a page element this one, and then drop it here and as you can see now it has a starting page page break brick and in aging so that's it now the next thing you need to do is go and drop a for example a drop down just drop it below the started start paging and to customize that one just click this small arrow here and you will see an option so just if you want if you have a bunch of shown you can do this one here for example let's just say have one and start choice and you want to require this one to trigger if user is not choose any of the option so how old are you so for example that one and then if you want to if you want default choice here just go in click this one and for those who want to add custom CSS you can add your class name here and that's it so we are now going to the second page so I'll just go again and 
create a multi select on the second page and just go again you want many option so this is just for a demo so I'm copy then now the only problem here is that it only have two step so if you want more step just drag again a page below the page back below or before the end page so that's it and then you can now go and uh, drag another option so for example you want a website the email and for those who want again a fourth step just drag again here and drop drop it at the top of the end so that's it you'll now just save it for a demo then once you have uh, integrate or I mean once you have done creating your multi step page just go to the, your page and from here we will just create a demo or for example this one just uh, then as you can see once you have installed a cavity uh, forms you will see this one a button button just click that one and select a form so this is the demo form which is we created created earlier and then insert then this is the form is now inserted and then let's just publish it for now again this is for a demo and then we will see let's preview the chain. page and you can see a oh, by the way this is a step so if you want to achieve this one you can update that one just go to the forms again just go to the forms and edit your form created and then here at the starting page just click this one and again you can choose progress or step and you can put a of three I mean yeah so that's it and then click update or if you want to have no steps click none so just refresh and as you can see the changes is now change okay so just choose and then second step here so select for example here so that's it guys you now have a multi-step multi-step form using a gravity form so that's it thank you for watching this video hope this video is helpful you creating your uh, page or a campaign for your mailing list so that's it for now thank you for watching guys